Well, come on in out of that uh, cold, snowy weather that we're having today. Well, actually, it was, uh, I think it was in the 60s today. Probably going to be in the 60s tomorrow. But anyway, uh, come on in. Let's take a look at your inspection report. So stay with me. Okay, now let's take a look at the inspection report and see how it reads out. This is a generic report. This is exactly what you will get, only your information obviously will be filled into all these blanks. The upper right-hand corner of the report is the legend. Each one of these initials pertain to something. A is consistent with the age of the chimney. B, C comments below. C, repairs needed. D, need further evaluation or E, not applicable. And they're placed into the boxes next to the parts of the chimney that can be easily identified in this diagram. And then, of course, you'll find my comments here below. Now let's take a look at your particular, your personal report. So stay with me. Hey Stevie, it was great to see you out at the house today uh, and your client. Beautiful house, great location too. Let's, um, let's go up on top. Let's see that it's got a stainless steel cap covering the whole top of the chimney. Uh, because of the height of the cap, you can see where blowing rain could go down the flue system, right, in blowing rainstorms. And we've had a lot of calls under certain circumstances where people have had rain going down the chimney. Here's what it looks like under the lid. You notice that water could easily just pour down in there. Um, so just keep that uh, in your mind. There's not much we can do about that. The chimney has to breathe. Uh, oh, let's stay up there for a second. Let's take a look at the flu system. Flu system is unlined. State of North Carolina will not allow you to burn wood or vented gas logs in an unlined chimney. And that's what you have in there now is vented gas logs. Reason for that is they produce a truck load of carbon monoxide. You don't want it leaching into the walls of your home. These unlined chimneys have cracks and holes all the way up and down them. And so that would not be a good thing. So my recommendation is going to switch these logs out to a clean burning set of vent-free gas logs. Vent-free means complete combustion, no carbon soot, no carbon monoxide, no worries about anything getting into the walls of the house and causing you a problem. So vent-free gas logs is going to be your choice there. Missing a little mortar in the firebox area. This is called the profile joint. It needs to be repaired. It's a code violation. We'll go ahead and seal that up for you, given your price on doing that. This fireplace was invented, it was built before dampers were invented, and flu systems, by the way, that's why there's no flu system in there. And uh, so there's no damper here, that's not causing you any problems. Folks have questions for me, give me a call, 704-526-6348. You can email me at chris at affordablesweep.com.